believed by many. Just beautiful. All metal will last for generations and generations. This is the way you start traditions for the holidays. You know, when I look at my family tree, you know, the tree that, that my mom's been decorating for years, every ornament on there is a little memory for me. And every ornament, I think, well, I like to call ornaments emotional time capsules because they are always a nice way of remembering who gave them to you or where you got them from or the year you got them or maybe what happened in that year. Like, I got married this year, so every ornament on our tree that we got this year, we put a little 94 on it so we remember that we bought it during the year that we got married. And that makes each one of those ornaments very special. We have um, a special ornament that my mom bought us, especially for our first Christmas. We have one from Beth's grandma, Nita, for our first Christmas. Maybe this can be your first Christmas ornament. First Christmas for a new baby. First Christmas for, you know, new, new parents. You know, people have step parents that are added into the family. You want to commemorate those moments. You want to make those people feel special this angel ornament, and this is a set of two, you know, we're showing a close-up of this, this angel heart ornament, but we also have a five-pointed angel star ornament. Let me hold them up together. Just beautiful, beautiful ornaments here. Incredible value. Fifteen eighty-four for two ornaments. That's like, like less than eight dollars for each one. And considering these are made of metal, guaranteed to withstand the test of time, I mean, your grandchildren someday will be looking at these ornaments thinking, geez, remember when Grandma bought those? Well, that's the way to start memories. It all, all it takes, you know, a memory starts with one moment. It may be a, a tradition that you've carried on for 20 years, but think about the traditions you have in your family. Well, they started with one moment 20 years ago. Somebody bought the ornament that, you're, that you love to, to, to look at and that reminds you of those special moments 20 years ago. All pressed metal. You know, just as it picks up all the light here in our Q2 store, it's going to do the same thing in your tree. And, you know, against my hand, you're not getting even a, a rich color variation. Think about this gold nestled in with your green evergreen. I mean, I don't even see that, that much green around me, but wouldn't this look beautiful against the evergreen in your tree? This is style number H17938. Quantities are limited, and we're like, you know, you're getting all the, all the benefit here because it's first quality merchandise at 1584 an incredible price here so really place your call to q2 1-800-345-1331 and order these angel ornaments a wonderful tradition to start to keep to treasure forever beautiful okay now let's move on and talk about our celestial ornament set and this is a, another combination of ornaments we have three together where are they here they are just beautiful so any people who like astrology, you know, any people who follow the signs of the zodiac, let me set these up on my hand here so I can show them to you kind of nicely. Now these are made of salt dough, again, natural textile dyes are used, and they're covered in a polyurethane. And what they've done is they've taken sort of a, a gold, um, it looks like a, like a glue pen, those kind of puffy pens that sort of is a little raised, and they've just made little dots all over them. Little dots all over the star, a little eight-pointed star. Reminds us of that first star, the star underneath baby Jesus was born. And here's a little crescent moon, also beautiful, all outlined, little eye, and a little sun face. Perfect. Keep, keep that sunny weather as a little remembrance for us. Our celestial ornament set. So anybody who loves astrology, anybody who likes looking at the stars, you know, astrology or astronomy. You know, astrology is the study of the signs of the zodiac. And astronomy is a study of the heavenly bodies. And I'm not talking about heavenly bodies like you just saw on Rachel's show. <laughs> We're talking about heavenly bodies, the kind in the sky. <laughs> Our celestial ornament set. Three ornaments for 1144. Now, we've seen gingerbread men salt dough ornaments. We've seen our little gnomes salt dough, salt dough <laughs> ornaments. And now we have our celestial ornament set. Another very nice way of just adding to your Christmas spirit adding to the fun in your house for that Christmas season. Now, I'm standing here all alone for two hours here. We're just beginning our second hour. We're talking about Christmas on sale here in our Q2 store. I'd like to hear some phone calls. I guess, uh, am, I, am I really alone here tonight, folks? Just pick up the phone, call 1-800-345-1331. Tell me your resolution, maybe some after Christmas tips. Maybe if you have somebody that you're buying a birthday gift for in January, I don't care. Any reason to buy a buy a product I want to hear it so give me a call here on Q2 okay that's our celestial 
ornament set. 1144 for three. H17967 is the style number. Let's put these down here. And next up is our tree stocking. This is a really cool stocking. Here it is. The little tree. Now, I often mention when I do the Christmas shows, Little House on the Prairie, because I think that really, you know, it's so warm and cozy. You know, that Little House on the Prairie feeling is, you know, it's old world America. It's classic. It's folk art and craft, you know, craft fair kind of things. And I think this tree stocking really makes me think of that whole type of Christmas. You can see stitched right onto a red burlap back, it says Merry Christmas. Nicely hand stitched too, you know. This isn't, you know, perfect little letters. Each one is gonna vary just slightly. You want them to be a little, a little, a little off-center, just a little quirky, because that way you really know it was done by hand. Now as we pan down, look at this tree. Have you ever seen anything so cute with little buttons? They found, they used only like mother of pearl and white, white tone buttons with little pearls in it and amongst them, all stitched down beautifully. This is the kind of stocking that is really going to add to your Christmas. Now you probably see those horrible red furry ones with the white fur as well. Kind of nasty. Why not add to your Christmas holidays by making the stocking something special as well? This Christmas tree stocking is style number H19062 at 2314, an incredible value, marked down from 29. You know, I like the fact that they have thought of everything. Like even this little toe here. Can you see that little, the little uh, patch on the toe? I think that is so cute. Just adorable. A real country sampler feeling here. This is about 15 inches long and eight and a half inches wide. Now this is the perfect place for personalizing as well. You got your Merry Christmas here already. Maybe you have a, a newborn in the family a newborn daughter or granddaughter, son, grandson. Well, how about stitching that son or grandson or daughter or granddaughter's name right here in the bottom and writing 1994. You also have a whole back. You can put the name on the back if you want. Really easy to personalize these. Use an indelible marker or sometimes you have those, uh, those pens that you can like, um, actually um, like the glue pens you can use. Um, so many, you can even stitch it in if you want. So many wonderful ideas. Maybe get some buttons. Write the name in buttons. That would be cute. You just add a little of yourself to our Merry Christmas, our tree stocking, 2314. Just give the number, the style number, H19062, to our operators, and they'll help you out to get this tree stocking to you very quickly. Just beautiful. Now, next up, we have another Christmas stay. Oh, it's not staying. Put that down over there. Next up, we have another tree stocking. This one is our Christmas tree stocking. The other one was the tree stocking. This is the Christmas tree stocking. Now, I don't mind saying I am actually the proud owner of this stocking. Yes, this is Ed Cortese's personal stocking. Not exactly this one. I have a different one, but you know what I'm trying to say. 100% main wool. And when we looked for stockings, me and my new wife, we wanted something that had that country feel to it. but. I wanted something that was gonna stretch just a little bit so we could cram in all those gifts. And that's one of the things I liked about this stocking. I love the colors, the cream background here with the green tree on it, little gold star, and all the red stripes, almost like a candy cane all over it. This is style number H19052, just beautiful. A little hard at the top. And uh, you know, because this stretches, you can get a little bit more, more gifts in it, you know? You can really, really cram this baby. I mean, just a little bit. You can't. You couldn't fit a BMW in here. As much as I'd like to try, you couldn't get a Beamer in here. But stretches just a little bit. Very, very nice. Now this has the tree on one side, and the other side is the perfect place to do a name in buttons, like the last stocking we saw, stitched right in. So many different ways of personalizing. Maybe you want to put the date, 94, Jen, 94. My wife's sister's name is Jen, so we'll use her name as an example. Just a beautiful stocking. You know, maybe, uh, you know, families change. Families evolve over time. You know, maybe you have, uh, you know, a new baby. You know, maybe your family just adopted a new brother or sister. They need a new stocking. Maybe you got a new parent, a step-parent or something. They need a stocking. You know, I've had the same stocking that I've used all my life. It's at my parents' place, though. So now that I'm, you know, newly married and we've set up house ourselves, we needed to get stockings for ourselves. So there are reasons to get stockings in life, you just wanna make sure you get quality stockings. They're gonna last as great traditions.
throughout your whole your whole life. This Christmas tree stocking is a wonderful way. Well, this is a tradition in my family. This is the stocking that I own. So I know this is going to be a part of my Christmas traditions for the next 20, 30 years. That's the reason we bought it. We specifically looked for a stocking that we'd have forever. Okay, and that's why we bought this one. If you're looking for something that's going to last a long time, take it from me, because I bought it too. This is the one to get. Just beautiful. Style number H19052, $20.64 which is much less than I got it for because I bought it before Christmas, right? What can you do? You win some, you lose some. I lost, I bought it before. You're going to win. You're buying it now. You're calling Q2. Definitely, this is the stocking to get. There it is. Okay. H19052, just $20.64. Put this back here. Now, anybody out there like to make homemade gifts? Do you make fudge or cookies or... You know, even you just like to give candy around as a gift around the holidays. Well, if you do, well, you need these. Can you see what this is? It's a little gift box. A little gift box with a window in it. You get a set of 12 gift boxes, each one with a little window in it. Now, these measure three and three quarters by two and a half by four and three quarters. Four and three quarters high, three and three quarters wide, and two and a half inches wide on this side here very very cool my wife makes fudge and she goes out and she buys gift boxes and ribbons and tissue paper and all that stuff and let me tell you after she's bought all that stuff it's no longer an inexpensive gift however when you buy this set of 12 it will be an inexpensive gift because 1584 gets you 12 little boxes i think like each one of the boxes my wife well maybe not each box for 15 bucks but i know she didn't get 12 for no 15 bucks it didn't happen that way Here's another opportunity for you to think ahead, make your life easier, and it's going to make your life a little less costly as well. You just buy some candy, you make some fudge, you make some brownies, you make some cookies, and with this set of 12 boxes, you immediately have all your gifts made. You don't even need to wrap these, because they come with a little gift tag on top, a little Christmas tree gift tag. You can take off if you want to. You can take this off if you want. But isn't that cute? And it's got a little window, so everyone's going to see what's inside. You know, you could even put candy in there, and then maybe you bought your someone like a, a piece of jewelry. You could wrap the jewelry in and among the candy, sort of surprise them a little bit. What about an ornament? You know, if you gave an ornament, like, let me see if I have any ornaments that might fit here. Like, I mean, I bet this little heart ornament here would fit inside here beautifully as a gift. You just put tissue paper, push it up into the front of the window, and wouldn't that be a nice little gift? It's the ornament, it's a little gift box, it's sweet, it's thoughtful, and it's inexpensive. Why? Because you're thinking now, you're seizing the opportunity to call Q2 and order these little gift boxes. You get 12, okay? 12 little gift boxes. And they're easy, too. I mean, look, this is how you open them. Well, right now, you're seeing just a whole jumble of the boxes all together. Let me show you how you open them. See, this is so easy. The back here, do we like, oh, no, okay, I can do it. I was afraid I was going to rip it for a second there if it was taped down. But you can see, you see how easy that was? It just slips right into these little slots right on the side, right there. And once you open it up, very generous room in size inside of here. Very cool. This will probably hold about a half a pound of, of candy. Half a pound of candy or maybe 12 little squares of fudge, depending on how big you cut those squares. Maybe a stack of four cookies, a bunch of brownies. So easy. And homemade gifts are gifts from the heart. It takes you time, but it doesn't take as much money. So that's a nice way of saving. Here you can save in another way. By calling Q2, there's a number right down there, 1-800-345-1331. And there's that style number. The style number is H19894. Just give the Q2 operators that style number, and you're going to have a set of 12 window boxes speeding their way to you. They're going to come all boxed up, all nice and neat. So you just write what they are in the exterior, you put it in the basement, put it in the, uh, in the attic, and, well, you've just done a little shopping ahead of everybody else, and you save money at the same time. Beautiful. These are our window gift boxes, a set of 12, 1584, but only if you act quickly. Now, let's see. Oh, this is fun coming up next. Our Hazel Witch Doll. She's so cool. Now, let me see if I can leap over here and get her down. Check her out. This is our Hazel Witch Doll. <laughs> Just look at her. Is she a riot? 
Her hair is hysterical. It's all curly. She's got this big old nose. Look at this nose. Of course, naturally, she's got a couple warts on it. What's a witch without a wart on her nose? Look at her little face. She sort of has a little scowl on there, but I bet you could cheer her up a little bit. Her hat, very fashionable hat, a little touch of lace. She's got a little lace in her hat and this big old beautiful orange flower here. And look at her dress. She's got a little orange top on and a, and a green dress and a little black sash that goes around her waist. She's got her little bag, her little trick-or-treat bag. She is 32 inches tall. She is a pretty big witch. Now, I think about her in a kid's room, she'd be so much fun. Even in the kitchen, you know, you find yourself working alone in the kitchen. Wouldn't it be nice if you had a pal to hang out with? How about Hazel the Witch Doll? Very cool little witch that she is. And again, she's not that little. She's 32 inches high. Let's just set her down in this chair. She looks so cute just sitting in a chair, doesn't she? Well, there she's sitting in a box. Of course, she can sit anywhere, you know, set her up on a little couch corner of the chair in a living room. I've seated her down in this little chair here with me, and she's pretty cool, isn't she? You know, she'll hang out, she'll keep you company. You know, she's gonna be girlfriend, you know? Girlfriend. <laughs> she's so cool. Little, little, this is Hazel the Witch. Let's see, totally hand-painted, totally handmade. You know, if you appreciate that kind of handiwork, you're really going to appreciate Hazel the Witch. Now, I don't know if she's a good witch or a bad witch. Remember Glinda from The Wizard of Oz? I still hate those flying monkeys. Let me tell you, I think she might be a good witch. But I guess it all depends in terms of the household. Because, uh, you know, if you got a good household, she's going to be a good witch for you. And I think, you know, uh, well, I've never, never experienced a bad household, so I think she's probably going to be a good witch no matter where she goes. She is so much fun and a great price, $67.94. At $85, she was a great value, a great bargain. But at $67.94, what's not to like about this? Remember, you don't have to go far. Just stay at home in the convenience and comfort of your own home. Let me hold her up a little bit. Look at her arms. Her arms are so cute. She sort of has like little spindly arms, you know. She can do a little dance. Maybe she's doing a little witch rap. <laughs> yeah, you can have a good time with this. Okay. Now this is our Hazel Witch Doll, $67.94 is the price, H19073 is the style number that you want to give to your Q2 operators. Now let's set Wendy up over here, I don't want to keep her as far away as she was before. Maybe we'll give her an apple. You hungry, Hazel? There you go, babe, we'll give you an apple. Okay, now Hazel has a little friend, her little friend, Wendy. Now of course we have a friend, Wendy, we all know and love Wendy Rogers. This is nothing like Wendy Rogers, because Wendy is Wendelicious. Our little Wendy the Witch doll here, she's pretty delicious too, but she's not as good as our Wendy Rogers, right? Gosh, isn't little Wendy cute? Well, maybe she is as good as Wendy Rogers. Maybe she's bad, though. I mean, Wendy, Wendy Rogers is probably bad, and this, this little witch is probably good. Now, she is just like her big sister in that she has a little orange top. She's got a little black sash. She's holding her trick-or-treat her little trick-or-treat bag, and I can feel there's some buttons in this bag. She must have been a good little witch because she's got some little buttons she could probably make a little purse for herself for or something. Let's see. Oh, look at her legs. Her legs are so cute. This is probably rude looking up her skirt, but her little legs have these little stripe patterns on them, and look at her little feet. The big Wendy witch, uh, I mean uh, Hazel witch, the big one, she's got cute feet as well. But little Wendy has these little upturned feet. These are just like, remember in The Wizard of Oz when the house landed on the witch? These little feet sort of shriveled up and shriveled up under the house. Some of these remind you of those little feet that were under the house. <laughs> oh boy, she's so cute. Little checkered dress. And there's that adorable little expression on her face. Her little nose, little eyes, and little rosy cheeks. Also handmade. So if you appreciate handmade handwork and handmade pieces, well you must, you must order this little little Wendy Witch doll. Now, Wendy Witch is $30.34. She is a style number. Oh, well, I, well, I'm sorry. I can't quite see the style number. Oh, there we go. H19072. <laughs> oh, we're having a lot of fun in our Q2 warehouse sale here. It is bedlam here, but this bedlam is going to mean that you are definitely going to get the value because, well, you're ordering now. You're saving time. You're saving hassle. And little Wendy Witch is going to be great company. You know, this may be in our Christmas show sale, but Wendy Witch, she is fun all year long. 
And if you order it now, you're going to be glad you did, because when Halloween comes, isn't this witch going to be a cool little thing? Now, what about, what about the kitchen witch? Have you ever seen those kitchen witches? Everyone has little witches in their kitchen. So uh, this is something that I think everybody would love to have in their kitchen as well. Just keep them company and keep you feeling good. Keeps those spirits all very, very happy and satisfied. This is our Wendy Witch Doll. H19072 is the style number. 3034 is the price. And again, I haven't heard any resolutions out there. I'd love to have somebody call to tell me a New Year's resolution that they have. And maybe, uh, well, maybe some Christmas tips about how they pull that Christmas tree down in a nice, organized way. We're going to go to a little break now, give you an opportunity to call to order your Wendy Witch or your Hazel Witch. And we're going to do some more ornaments when we come back. So stay with us. Uh, my New Year's resolution. Well, most people try to lose weight or stop drinking or stop smoking. But mine is just to have a good time all the time. Thank you. Two is open Wednesday through Sunday, 24 hours a day. Stop in, shop around from your living room. On Saturday, start your day off with our two-hour basic beauty special at 8 a.m. Eastern, 5 a.m. Pacific. At 2 p.m. Eastern, 11 a.m. Pacific, the guest room features the Aero Bed, a great addition to any home. Get ready to open yourself to new experiences with Q2 for your mind, featuring guest Stephen Pacero at 4 p.m. Eastern, 1 p.m. Pacific. And shop for t-shirts and caps from Melrose Place at 8 p.m. Eastern, 5 p.m. Pacific. Q2, shopping from TV. There's a first time for everything. resolution is I never want to work again <laughs> and be in Bermuda <laughs> now yeah. what do you mean never work again this is Q2 this is work that's fun this is work that's fun because we're giving you some great values here and I kind of like that you know I love it when I get some great value now this is a time of year after Christmas we're all looking for great values great bargains on Christmas things Nine times out of ten, though, you get caught up in that hassle, that, I mean, that craziness in the stores. You get all caught up in it. You bring it home, you look at it, it's like, I bought this. It's chipped. It's fallen apart. There's a leg missing, and I don't even like it. Well, that may be a problem you've had in the past with regular retailers, but no more. You shop from Q2 now, all right? So it's easy to do. Okay. Now, first up is our topiary ornament. Q2 shopping is so easy. And it is so cool because we have done the work for you. And right now you're getting all our hard work at an incredible, incredible price. This is our topiary ornament, okay? Now, isn't this beautiful? You've probably seen topiaries. When I think of topiaries, I always think of like Disneyland or Disney World, you know? Isn't this beautiful? This is real moss that's been put on here. Now, this is an ornament from Cherishables. Cherishables is a company that is known for their high quality. This is made of a pine wood, and it is all cut out using a jigsaw. You can see how thin these little parts are between the topiary balls. So really, this is very, very beautifully made. The garland on the base here, I mean, doesn't that look like a, it almost looks three-dimensional. It looks like it really is round, the base that it comes in. And look what they've done. They've put a little swag of ribbon around it. Just beautiful. Real moss. In fact, when we turn it sideways, you'll see that moss really comes off there, you can see it's sort of rounded. It is real moss. So this on the tree is gonna look just gorgeous. Little little birdie at the top. Little birdie there. <laughs> like a dove of peace at the top. And again, this is a very special ornament. Handmade at $21 for something made this beautifully, this delicately, and something that's gonna look that this nice on your tree, you know, I think really that's a, a great price, 21. Hey, we have it for $16.74. This is decorated on both sides. So you'll see when this moves on your tree, it looks just beautiful, really very special. And again, since it's on both sides, you can, uh, it's going to look great no matter how it hangs. You know, there's always that battle to make it hang straight, make it hang straight. Well, this one is always going to be perfect because straight is any size, any side at all. 1674 from Cherishables. Style number is H18094. And of course, that style number is very important to the operators. You just give them the style number. Before you know it, your order's taken care of. You can go about your business. 
go on with your day, no hassle, no lines, no salespeople, convenient, and you can return it without leaving your house. It's going to save you time, it's going to save you money because you don't have to deal with parking spaces or gas or anything like that. Okay, we put our topiaries down, and now we're going to move to our garden to check out our little garden tool ornaments. Look at these! Can you believe this? Now, I've told you before, every time I see garden things, I always think of my mom because she loves the garden. Let me move our little angels out of the way. And I'll put our little bird houses away. We talked about these a little earlier. And we'll get our little garden tools set up. Have you ever in your life seen anything so cute? Look at this little wheelbarrow. Watch the little wheel turn. Really works, okay. Inside it, you can see three little garden tools. There's a little spade, a rake, and a hoe. There's also a little watering can and a little little basket of flowers. And look at these flowers. Aren't they sweet? This is all, and these are like real dried flowers here. Okay, this isn't plastic. No chinzy stuff here in Q2. High quality. This is one of the cutest little ornaments I've ever seen. 1754, you'd think that this wheelbarrow alone would be 1754, right? Not so, because you get three in this set. Let me just set this one down here. Now check out this next in our trio. This is a rake and a shovel together. And what does it say? Weekend gardener. I bet you know a weekend gardener, don't you? If you do, wouldn't it be nice to give this as a little Christmas gift next year? And you can just order it now when the box shows up. Just write that person's name on it. You know, Uncle Joe, gardening ornaments, gift for Christmas 1995. And that's the way you keep your life organized. Scratch another name right off the list. Remember, this is the second of three pieces that come in our garden tool ornaments. The other one is one of my favorites. Look at this. Oh my God, it's a little lawnmower. Can you believe this? Is this the cutest thing? Everybody, everybody who sees this, first thing they do is see if it works. And everyone is always so happy when they see that it works. It's a little lawnmower. This is so cute, so much fun, guaranteed to delight everybody. You know, my parents have a big garden. They've got a victory garden, all natural. My dad's got a little orchard. So my dad, my parents, they totally peace out in their garden. You know, on the weekend, whenever I call the house and nobody answers, I know exactly where they are. They're out in the garden. So I think I'm going to have to order this garden tool ornament set for my mom and dad because this would be a great little gift for next Christmas, I think. I'm going to try to get my Christmas shopping organized. This year, you know, Q2 made it so easy for me because I bought everything. Well, for the most part, I bought a lot of things off Q2, which made it very easy. I think next Christmas is even going to be easier because I'm going to do all my Christmas shopping throughout the year, and I already have this down for mom for next year. It's just a little something. You know, for $17.54, I can even afford to get her something else as well. So I can get a little extra for mom, and that's a nice thing to do for the holidays. When you save a little bit in one place, you can spend a little bit more someplace else. Garden tool ornaments, a set of three. You know, three, can you believe it? Our little wheelbarrow. It has three tools, a basket of flowers, and a little watering can, our weekend gardener, and our little lawnmower. These are so beautifully mad. You know, just out of curiosity, I think everybody who's watching right now should really just place the call just to see how beautifully these are made. When you get them home, you are going to be so pleased that you called because they are so attractive. Why isn't it? There you go. <laughs> beautifully made. Fun. And because they're so cute, everyone's going to love them. I mean, they'll be on the tree, and people are going to, like, you know how there are just a few ornaments that everybody touches all the time? Oh, that one's so cute. I love that one. It's so adorable. Well, this, I'm telling you, this is going to be one of those ornaments that it's just going to cute everybody to death. Okay, have you ever been cuted to death? Okay, this is going to cute you to death. Okay, I just love these. And again, I think of my parents. Who are you thinking of when you see these little garden tool ornaments? You know, maybe you have a window box and that's your little garden. Maybe you have, you know, 40 acres and a mule, you know, maybe you have a really big garden. Maybe, maybe you're a farmer, you know, backbone of America and God bless all our farmers for putting food on our table here. Hey, if you're a farmer, do you love to farm? You got a garden. So many people would love this. You know, my parents really are weekend gardeners, just like it says on this one. They really are, you know, during the week they both work. So the weekend, they're weekend gardeners, and they love it because it's so relaxing. Our garden tool ornaments, a set of three. You get everything you're looking at. The little lawnmower, the little shovel and rake, 
and our little wheelbarrow, which is chock full of stuff. All three for $17.54. H17976 is the style number. You know, if you're even on the verge and considering them, just write this style number down, a brief description. You can call it any time, 24 hours a day. It's so, so easy to do. Now for the kids. We talked about my parents in the garden. Something for the kids. And I shouldn't even just say the kids because my wife loves bunnies too. She actually has a basket full of stuffed bunnies next to her bed. And this could be another sweet little addition to her bunny collection. Look at this. It's our rabbit and carrot ornament set. And you can see, I love these because they're still really simple. You know, uh, it's easy to over ornament, uh, over decorate um, cookies like this, especially cookies for the tree. These are so simple, they haven't lost any of the traditional cookie charm. I mean, look at our little bunny, our little bunny rabbit. Just simple gingerbread, the color of gingerbread, and all they've added was this little touch of white epoxy to give him a little cotton tail. So cute. Little little hook at the top here. She just put a red ribbon, a green ribbon, a plaid ribbon, a gold ribbon, any kind of ribbon, any kind of size you want. Now the second in our set of two is a big old carrot. Probably make a nice dinner for that little bunny rabbit. And you can see the little etchings, the lines on it, really give it the texture and feel of a real carrot. Salt dough is used, so it's totally non-toxic. Natural textile dyes are used as well, also non-toxic, and covered in a polyurethane so that it will last a long time. You know, little animals, you know, if you have pets, dogs and cats and stuff, sometimes if they see a cookie like this, they will want to try and eat it. These are non-toxic, so no one's going to get hurt. And that's very important. We like to keep our, our pet friends safe. They are part of the family. The rabbit and carrot ornament set, $8.64. I mean, that's like incredible value here. Two ornaments for under nine bucks. H17969 is the style number. So cute. And that's, I think, something for the whole family to enjoy, the rabbit and carrot ornament set. Okay, now here's another really clever, clever little thing. Let me bring these out for you. Let's see, find a, let's find a place to set these down. Maybe I'll just tuck these over. These are so useful and so adorable, you're not going to believe it. Just, okay, set that up there. Let me get a few more just to show you what you can do with them. These are our holly trim and candle holders. So clever, so clever. Come with me, look at this. First of all, you get these candle holders. You get two, and they're so simple. Can you see that? So simple, just a bent wire that allows you to stick it in almost anything you want. Now, these will perch on the side of a bowl like this. Maybe you have, whoa, maybe you have a big punch bowl. I'll just put that on there. Yeah, you do have to stick it down just a little firmer than what I did. I just sort of sat it on it. But these are marvelous, and they are so, they have so many uses. There you go, just perched on the side of a bowl. Maybe you have a big punch bowl you like to decorate. You know, this is certainly going to do that. I like to think of uh, maybe have plants. Maybe you have potted plants at home. You know, when you stick these in a potted plant, immediately your potted plant becomes a candle holder. And it's such a natural way of adding a little festive attitude to the potted plants you have around the house. Now, of course, there are so many other places where you could put these. You know, maybe you made a big cake. You can stick these right into the cake, turn your cake into a candle holder. Now, there is more. Now, you, not only do you get two candle holders, like what you see here, one for each side of a casserole or a cake, you also get these little sprigs, okay? Now, these sprigs just have a little bit of wire around them. There's no clip or anything, just a little bit of wire. So what you can do is, you know, like on a candle, when the, when the drippings begin to hang down, you just take this, and this will sort of like hook itself onto the little candle drippings, and you could add a little piece of holly right in the middle of your candle. You turn this around front so you can see it a little, little bit better. Did you see that? And you can just put that right on your candle, and it's going to sit there and just look absolutely beautiful. Just gorgeous. And it doesn't look like real holly. It's all shiny, beautiful red berries on it. I think this is so clever. There are so many places that you can use this. Now, if you don't want to put your holly there, you can just rest your holly over the side of the bowl as well. You know, just hang it on the side there just to add a little bit of decoration to your home. Also perfect on the side of a potted plant. Just look at that. 
You can decorate anything, any place, at any time. It's easy. I love the potted plant idea. You can put them in an empty punch bowl, maybe put ornaments all on the inside, fill it up with mixed nuts, candy. I mean, so many uses for something like this. This is our holly trim and candle holders. 2314, you get two candle holders, you get six little holly sprigs, just like this one. Perfect, perfect for any place, and guaranteed to add a little bit of holiday cheer in those unexpected places. This is really, really fun. About four inches long. Each one of these candle holders is about four inches long from tip to tip. 2314, style number H19741. Okay, now earlier in the show we showed you a vine wreath that you could do anything you wanted to, and one of my ideas I actually got from this wreath. This is our garden time wreath, and I thought this was so clever. Check this out. Our garden time wreath is a wreath made out of all sorts of spice leaves. Well, actually, we never got back to our question. My question about this, the difference between spices and herbs. Spices are seeds, herbs are leaves. Isn't that interesting? It's so simple, but people don't always know, don't often know that. Now, this one, this here, has been made all of different kind of herbs because they're all leaves, you can see. Beautiful dried flowers, little terracotta plant, uh, little pots with moss inside them have been tied right into this wreath. Even little packets of seeds. Look, here we got some radishes, some peas. So this really has a wonderful summer country garden feeling. Just beautiful. This is the kind of thing, you put this on a wall, and everyone's going to just feel warm and fuzzy because it reminds us of the garden of harvest time. You know, perfect kind of country embellishment. You've seen the magazines, the decorator magazines for interior design. You see the kitchens, the bathrooms. They always have little things like this, and then tucked in little corners. Maybe you have a narrow wall that you can't really put a piece of furniture on. A little something like this could be that very thing you need to just tuck on a wall. What a nice gift, too. I think it'd be a beautiful gift for anyone to get. You can see all the different things that go into it. Now, we have dried lemon leaf in here, flax, moss, pennyroyal, little clay pots, again, those little seed packets, and, of course, a beautiful raffia bow that's been used as well. Just beautiful. This is H18770. You know, if you have a garage door, perfect for the garage door around the holiday time. Maybe you have a garden shed, a place where you keep all your gardening things. You can put this on the door of your shed, maybe inside the shed, a mud room, a laundry room, a kitchen, a bathroom.